Are you ready to turn your dreams into reality? Imagine a simple technique that could help manifest your deepest desires while you sleep. A simple two-word technique before sleep will attract any of your dreams and desires to come alive. It's one thing to put in a lot of effort and work hard, but it's another to actualize your ambitions if your spiritual alignment is off. It can be a little challenging. Here's the deal. It's about aligning your intentions with your subconscious, paving the way for abundance and success. Have you ever wondered why some effortlessly attract prosperity while others struggle endlessly? You've seen so many people going with the flow of life and getting whatever they put their minds to, just living their life with abundance and peace. It's not just about grinding endlessly, and you know what, even super successful people have faced this at some point. But guess what? In this video, I'm going to share a seriously cool technique to help you beat that fear of failing and start making real progress towards your goals. Trust me, it's going to be awesome. Join me as we explore this powerful two-word technique to unlock your path to fulfillment. Before we get into the technique, let's understand why it works. Okay, check this out. You, me, everyone. We're all wired the same way. We're born to do stuff and visualize things. And hey, we're not meant for poverty, seriously. None of us are. It's just how we're trained to think. But guess what? We've got the power to change that. It's all about flipping that mindset. If you start thinking differently, your whole future could change. You could be living your dream life, rolling in wealth, feeling amazing. Being rich doesn't mean you have to be sick or unhappy. You've got the power to change it all just by changing how you think. Ever heard people say your genes determine everything and you can't change it? Well, let me drop some truth bombs on that. Your emotional state plays a huge role in your health. Seriously, your body is constantly regenerating cells, like millions every second. Science says so. So if our whole body gets a makeover every few years, why would illness stick around? It's all in your head, literally. Metaphysics and quantum physics have been geeking out over this stuff for ages. And guess what? Even mainstream science is starting to catch on. You've been programmed to expect struggles and failures, but here's the kicker. You can reprogram that. Yep, it's all about tweaking your mindset. Once you do that, you're opening doors to awesome stuff. Great relationships, tons of cash, and a whole universe of possibilities. You know, sometimes convincing someone else is one thing, but the real challenge is convincing your own mind, especially the sneaky subconscious part. Your own mind, especially the sneaky subconscious part, holds all the answers. Seriously, it's like a supercomputer in there. Ever try telling your brain to wake you up at a certain time? It's crazy, but it actually works. Like you can set your alarm mentally and bam, you're up right on time. Now think about sleep. We spend a third of our lives knocked out, recharge mode activated, and if you skimp on sleep, you'll be cranky, moody, and feeling down. So getting enough sleep isn't just important. It's essential for staying happy and upbeat. Oh, and dreams. They're like your brain's way of dropping hints while you sleep. Ever had those light bulb moments in a dream? Yeah, it happens to loads of us. Your subconscious is like a ninja. It never really sleeps. When it's in that chill, open mode, it's totally down to listen to whatever you throw its way. And guess when it's most receptive? Right before you hit the hay. That's why we often dream about whatever's on our minds before we drift off. Plus, while you're catching your snoozes, your body's busy releasing healing vibes, so you wake up feeling fresh and ready to conquer the day. In a day, we get caught up in the daily grind, schoolwork, chores piling up, and work deadlines. But right before you go to bed, it's like a special time when you can forget about all that and think about good stuff instead. It's like a magic time. If you do this every night, it can make a big difference. Trust me, I've tried it, and it works. All right, let's break it down. So Neville Goddard and Jesus both had some wisdom to share about imagination and praying. Basically, it's not just about thinking, it's about feeling too. 
Jesus said when you pray, believe you've already got what you're asking for, and it'll happen. So what does this mean? Well, first off, when you imagine your dreams, don't just think about them. Visualize them like you're watching a movie in your head. And here's the kicker. Act like you've already got what you're dreaming of. Be happy. Let go of any grudges and just vibe like you've already got it all. It's not just about how you feel. It's about using those feelings to picture what you want. Still confused? Don't worry, we'll break it down step by step. Okay, here's what you can do. Grab a notebook and make a list of all the things you want in life. Don't hold back. Dream big. Put them in order from most important to least. Then read through your list and imagine each thing as if it's already happening. Like if you wrote down that you want a big house, picture yourself chilling in the garden, feeling proud of all your hard work paying off. You can do this with anything you want, whether it's a dream job, a special someone, or whatever matters most to you. Then, step it up a notch and really imagine experiencing it like it's happening right now. Even if you only get through a few goals before you doze off, it's okay. Your brain knows what's most important to you, even if you forget during the day. Let's talk about those two powerful words we mentioned earlier. Dr. Joseph Murphy, the genius behind the power of the subconscious mind, has a killer technique. Pick two words that match what you want most in life. Say you're after love, loads of cash, and tip-top health. You choose words like love and wealth, or health and success. Whatever floats your boat. Now, here's the kicker. Write these words down in your notebook like your dreams depend on it. Seriously, they hold the key to unlocking your desires. So pick those first two things you crave the most and jot down those words. These words are the secret codes that unlock your dreams. Your brain eats them up because they're linked to what you want most. So before you hit the hay, keep saying those words like a magic spell. Repeat them over and over until you drift off into dreamland. And hey, after you've imagined your dreams and said your piece, go back to those words. Make them your bedtime mantra and let them guide you into sleep. Stick to this every night, and trust me, you'll start seeing some serious changes. The key, keep it consistent. Give yourself a quick five before bed and watch the magic happen. And remember, manifesting isn't a replacement for working hard, planning smart with your money, or staying healthy. It's like an extra boost to keep you feeling positive and motivated while you chase after your health and wealth goals. So as you wind down for the night, take a moment to reflect. I want to leave you with a powerful reminder. Your dreams are within reach, and it all starts with a little bedtime ritual. Take those moments before sleep to envision your goals, plan for tomorrow, and set your sights on the future you want. You hold the power to shape your reality. Consistency is essential. Continue your practice over time and be patient with the manifestation process. Significant results may not always be visible right away. Stay grateful, stay determined, and keep pushing forward. Make these techniques a part of your daily routine and watch as they work their magic in your life. So go ahead, dream big, take action, and never doubt the process. With dedication and gratitude, there's no limit to what you